as you know it's your girl j beauty featuring my beautiful sisters so i guess this video will be a sister tag sister sister sorry guys, guys. So, no. we straight up in the ghetto by writing we in the hood it's used for the food bless the food bless the hands that made it bless the hands that body as we take in remembrance of you bless the rest of our day protect us and guide us safely in the name of jesus we love you amen so we ordered the mcdonald's spicy chicken nuggets mm, look at that oh the spicy one and we're gonna see how it's gonna taste so can i dip some in there i just want to see how it sure. tastes all right let's let's give it a try so grab one. these bags to dip let's cheers Two, three. Hmm. Whoa, these actually might be better than the regular one. Oh, actually good. Give us a nine. Mm hmm And I don't really like McDonald's um, chicken nugget like that. But whoa. These are really good. The Rick is spicy. So there's some questions. Okay. I knew I should. How many kids do you guys really want to have? A village. Fifteen. <laughs> <laughs> I want a lot. Yeah, me too. Must really have one. I want a lot of kids as much as nineteen kids and counting. I want to make a record. <laughs> Let's get thirty kids on the staff. <laughs> well, wow. <laughs> from the same father. Yeah. From the same father, amen. <laughs> but yeah, I feel you. Um, but do you do you want it to like you have kids, do you want them to all start with like the same letter of your name or your husband? Um I wish but no because there's some names that I want to name my kids that don't start with J's, so But I really do want a lot of kids, guys. Me too. Sorry, guys. I lost my voice during my birthday week. Yeah, so. Sorry. Yeah, I want like 10. I think it's because we just came from a big family. We're all about family. Like, you know. Yeah, I want to elaborate. I think because we come from a big family, we want a lot of kids. And it's so beautiful when they come together, you know. Or when, when the kids grow up, they get their families, and it's like, wow, you know? And you know what my brother said? One of my brothers, they want a lot of kids, too. He said he want, like, 10 or 12 kids, but he wants a lot because he wants to leave a legacy. And that's what I want to do, too, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, this generation is generation now, but I want them to leave a legacy from, you know, us paving the way for them, you know what I'm saying? But, yes, I want a lot of kids. Mm-hmm. If you could meet anyone in the world, alive or dead, who would it be? Wait, if you could what? If you could meet anyone in the world, mm. alive or dead, who would it be? Who would I be? Or meet? Me. Me. Mm. <laughs> Dang, I don't even know. Because I really don't want to be nobody but myself. No, me. Me, oh. man. Oh my gosh, me, no, no, are you okay? Who are you gonna be, bro? Then said it like 10 times. It's the heat, guys, the heat hey. is getting to Yeah, me. guys, my it's car. 90 degrees in day, you guys. My car, my car don't have AC, so we're literally, everything <laughs> has to be open. I'm sorry if it's like, you can hear everything in the background, but. My if I can meet anybody alive or dead, I would want to meet my Uncle Pedro. Mm -hmm. I peace to him. Um, I wasn't born when he was alive, but from my mom, uh, from what she told me, he was a really, um, he was a really good person. And like, he was one of those to like, if he were sad, he would hurt himself just to make you laugh. And you know, I just, I just want to meet him because like, I wasn't, I wasn't alive. Like, I wasn't born yet to meet him. So yeah, I just want to, want to meet him. Um, I be, I'm my uncle Pedro. <laughs> Or my grandpa. I was gonna say that. My grandpa from the Phoenix. Because um from what a lot of people told me he holds a my dad's high dad. Place. Yeah. He holds a high place, like in areas. I'm not explaining that book. <laughs> yeah. First of all I wanna meet um my auntie Noah again. Uh, rest oh, in peace. 
my auntie Noah, she was one of she was one of my favorite aunties and chill. Like we would always run to her if we got in trouble. And she was always there. And like literally after school, she would we would know. Like she would always take us to McDonald's she or did. take us to get junk food. And she's the only auntie and and with Uncle Matt. Both of them, we we could stay at the movie theaters for the whole day. Like, for, Auntie, that's my for, my, mm-hmm. that's my vibe. She could stay. She can go to the movies like every day and not have a problem with it. And she was the one that first introduced me Mountain Dew. And to this day, I didn't yes. The it. only reason why we drink Mountain Dew is for, for you, you, Auntie. For you, for you, Auntie, Auntie Noah. Period. Noah. Period. Yes, Auntie, Period. because of you. Exactly. But that's one person is my Auntie Noah, mm-hmm. and she would always, you know, correct us out of love. And you know we take that into, and yes, man, you know. And then second one I would want to meet is um, is Romeo Miller. Huh? Romeo Miller. <laughs> oh, He's from Nick. Of course, JoJo doesn't know because Romeo, 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 oh! Romeo. Ro- you guys don't know his what the? Yeah, no, Romeo. I'm thinking over here. I'm, I'm like, thinking, of like, I'm, I'm thinking. Do you remember Romeo and Juliet? No. I'm thinking Jojo. Of course, I wouldn't be surprised she don't know because she don't know. Romeo. I wasn't thinking he was gonna do a celebrity. That's why I didn't know. You know, matter of fact, I want me Michael B. Jordan. No, I'm my turn. Michael. It's my turn. <laughs> Romeo Miller. And why Romeo Miller? Wow. He wasn't just a actor, but I follow him like on social media too. And he even, uh, even like uh, what is that? He talks about his spiritual life too. You know what I'm saying? Like everything he does. You know, the gifts he has, he can't, like, what is that? He thanks God for it. Like, everything he do, because his dad taught him and raised him the way he is. And, like, he always be posting when um, his family, they have family Bible study. And I'm like, this celebrity, like, this celebrity? And he even posts about it, even his notes, and hope and praise and hope that it touches somebody. And I'm like, dang. And this dude, he's just focused on his grind. He's real about everything. He's making music. Um, even like, I guess, um, in some movies too, Romeo Miller. I really admire him, you know, as a celebrity too. He's an inspiration too. Some people might not think like that, but I really admire him too. So, Romeo Miller, I'm anti Well, Jojo already said who I, who I was, who I wanted to meet was my grandpa Feely Feely. Uh, my dad's father. We didn't get to meet him. Um, but yeah, I would love to meet my grandpa. Because one thing that I will never forget is that who told me? I don't know if it was dad or if it was uncle or one of them. But they told me that my uncle Feely Feely, he never let my grandma drive. Like... As long as he oh, lived, uncle. I said my grandpa. Oh, you said my oh. well, I meant my grandpa feeling feeling. He never let grandma drive. Like he he was always driving, and I think that's why the way my dad acts is the way he was raised from his dad. If you know my dad, he's like the best. Like he would do anything for my mom and his family, his kids. Like yeah. It's awesome where we ain't gotta worry about being fed. Right. And the change. We ain't gotta worry about being in trouble and dating. Mm-hmm. But the person I also want to meet is um I definitely want to meet Laurel's grandma that um passed a few years ago. Because everything that he told me was just like wow, like I really wish I could have met her. Is that his mom's mom or his dad? Yeah, his mom? mom's mom. Oh, what? Uh-huh. And then also MJ. Oh, Michael Jackson. Oh, oh, I was like. Who was your first crush? Oh, oh my um, first crush ahead, was Jesus. Jesus. Jesus, the Lord of all lords. Can I get an amen? That was <laughs> all of my first crushes. Because you know why? We all love Jesus. Amen. Okay. <laughs> Christina. Now, n- now your real answer. Go ahead, Tina. JoJo. I don't know who's going on. You're lying. You know Mama watching this, too? Mm-hmm. That's what she wants to say. Or maybe her quiz, she's watching this. Hell. Better not. I don't really care. I don't really have a quiz. She's like... No, no. Guys, in elementary, I was No, you know what's funny? My first crush 
What the hell y'all focusing on crushes for? No, it's not focused. It's just when you have a friend. Jojo, you had all that time. I know. So it's I, my turn. Stop lying. Anyways, my first crush was like in fourth, fifth grade. But it's so funny because it was one of my brother's friends. <laughs> and I will never forget his name. Confidential. Name? <laughs> I'm just joking. I don't even know his last name. Watch so. it be. His name is uh, Emmanuel. Okay. I was gonna say one. But he was chill. But it was just never mind. Anyways, go ahead, James. What was yours? No, mine was in fourth grade. I had a um, crush on this dude named Jeremiah. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm for real. Um, yeah. Jojo, <laughs> <laughs> don't get back, man. Okay, next was um, it was this, it was this light-skinned dude. I still remember he had braids. I don't know. And I, I, I remember him. He's the one that taught me how to spell because. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But how do you spell because? Because. Because. <laughs> Wait, just put a B and a cause. No, because in fourth grade, I still remember our teacher was Miss Cellini. And, dude, uh, I'm not gonna do any more videos with y'all because y'all just ruined it. I need a pee. What's so funny? <laughs> Miss Cellini. Yes. Woo. Go ahead, She was actually sorry. one of the coolest teachers. Thank you very much. How do you spell I didn't know how to spell oh. Hey, Jojo, yeah. you wanna tell them how you spell onions? Yeah, how you spell onions? <laughs> Jojo spelled it with a U. Well, he it. spelled it with a U. You know. Big oh, onions. now you know how to spell huh? Big. <laughs> how did you spell because? <laughs> I didn't know how to spell it. I didn't know either. So how did you spell because? What? But how old are you? How old were you? I was in fourth grade. Oh, okay. When, where, and who was your first kiss? Mine was, um, what's that college? Kumak. Oh. What? Gross Mom, Mar Mar the one right there behind Home Depot. The hell was you doing over there? ECC? Somewhere. Oh, well, yeah. Mine's UEI? No, right there behind Home Depot. Where we ministered at. But yeah, mine was there. Mine was like, I think it was, I, I know where it was. It was in Spring Valley. Beautiful view. <laughs> and that's when I got my first kiss. <laughs> By who? I don't say the person's name. We ain't together. No thanks, no thanks. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go there. Um. Wait, mine was, uh, yeah, I don't. Mm. I was like, what is one thing you've never told me? <laughs> Wait, never told you. I don't know because I tell you everything. Wow. Like me and my sisters were like, or Jojo, and this one just be. <laughs> I have you, mom. Jojo, what's one thing you never told us? Us? I mean, you guys are you. Me. Oh, um, well, this was recently. I dropped a damn two nugget in your car, and um, <laughs> I turned around. What? Jojo, you. D and um, did you pick it up? Yeah, and I ate it. Cause it fell. Like, you're weird. What was a moment in college or high school that you never want to rely to relive? To relive? Relive, sorry. Um, I think my elementary year. Those that know me, like, if I told you then, you know, you know me like this. But it's I don't I wouldn't relive my elementary year because um, I I was bullied so. I want to experience that again mm. in my life. So when people get bullied, well, besides my siblings, I love you guys. But I mean, like, when I see other people or kids get bullied, like, I will defend them and stand up for them and whatever because I don't like bullying. Like, and when we were little, yeah, bullying how... wasn't really emphasized. Our principal didn't really go over it. You know what I'm saying? I didn't know, like, bullying was even, like, cyberbullying, like, you know, even online. Like, I didn't even know that either. But I was bullied not by girls, but by boys. You know, because I was born with eczema, 
So they would call me names and all this. I would ignore it, and sometimes I would even skip school or lie like I'm sick just because I didn't want to, you know. But since now all those people are hitting me up now, too bad. Mm. Sorry. <laughs> but I wouldn't relive my elementary now. Um, for me, I honestly don't know, like, I was going to say this one time in eighth grade when I leaked through my pants from my period, and, um, it was fifth period, and Mr. Dang, what's his name? Godson or Godsko? Oh my god. Mr. Cos. No. Dang, I hella forgot his name. Wow. But um I'm Mr. Godson or Godson? Dang! I don't know, but if you know who I'm talking about, please comment that Is down he below. Like a talk teacher? Mr. Owen? He's like an average no, you don't know him. He's an average, he's um kinda old and he had um like a white beard or a white mustache whatever gray hair and he was bald in the middle but had hair around no <laughs> um anyways i was i had this friend named um julie julie beth and i like oh my goodness when we when we're together there's not a moment where we are not dying of laughter so I had leaked my pants and I stood up and she was like <gasps> and like I was like oh my gosh like you know when you just feel it yeah it was like so embarrassing especially because this, this dude that I used to like was in that class and I was like what the heck but yeah I mean I would say I don't want to relive that moment but at the same time it was hilarious so how did you really feel about the last gift that I bought you? <laughs> wait, 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 hold on, hold on. How did I feel? I loved it. Mm, what did okay. she get you? The love, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> if you could go back in time, would you change what you wrote, what you wore to prom? No. Me neither. I loved it. Yeah. And I'm grateful. Um, because one of my aunties, like, just out of love, wanted to pay for everything. And I, mm -hmm. you know, I told her no, it's okay, but she wanted to do it like as a gift, you know, for my senior year to not have my parents stressed about nothing. Cause I guess my parents is, both my parents is working, but they have like six kids, you know? Yeah. But it was so it was less stress off of them and me, because I was gonna look for a job my senior, year, but no, it's okay. But I thank you. Shout out to my auntie Leisha, Lilo, the Lilo clan, and Uncle Peter and Jerry. Much love. Is there something I did that you've never gotten over or forgiven? <laughs> no, I'm laughing because I'm like, there is, like, I mean, we fuss and fight, and then there's times we don't talk to each other, but my sister knows mm -hmm. that when, yeah, <laughs> sing it, sis. Copyright. But anyways, anyways. Anyways, you know, we all bump heads, but my sister knows when I give the silent treatment and I don't talk to her for like a whole day or two. Okay, but I don't talk to you too. Yeah, I know, same for her too. But she goes like this when she has her information. She's like, sister, I'm so sorry. Do you forgive me? Like, I didn't mean that. And you know, I love you all, but let's go get something to eat. <laughs> Jojo, on the other hand, is there something I've done or we've done that you haven't forgotten or gotten over or forgave okay cool just a, she's thinking like that but i'm like her birthday's coming up so please comment leave a comment a shout out my sister's birthday's this week show some love y'all yes she's turning 14 14 i'm turning a number y'all need to know her first Girl. freshman year in high school all right um when did you actually have your first drink Hey guys, so while I was editing this video, I just wanted to add a little quick video or whatever that for those who might be wondering why we're telling this story or whatever and honestly it's because, you know, I just want to keep it real with you. Everything on my channel is going to be 
raw, uncut, and real. So obviously we're not perfect PKs and you know, things happen. So, and we were probably like, we were honestly kind of still young. I was still in high school and Ina probably just graduated, so. Yeah. Wait, we had it the how same time. the hell? Wait, wait, okay, that, to answer that question. Hold on. I didn't mean to drink. We, we went wait, to we this, both did we it both, the same time. It was the same time because. And, uh, well, no. It was at a baby shower. Yes. And let me tell you. Tell them. We was at this baby shower, right? We got invited though. And I felt bad because nobody was playing the games. Like, like you know how they just... have like games during the baby shower. But we came late from another event to go to this one. And you and know my dad told us to Oh, you guys go, you know, go um go participate. Yeah, go participate. Because don't thing. just come here for the food. I'm like, but we you know, we bought a present yeah. too. But I'm like, Dad, but you know, they they we're here, so they're thankful. They're like, but participate, you know? And I said, Dad. So, to skip to the story. Long story short. We participated, right? And it was, guess what's in the bottle? The baby bottle, guys. The baby bottle. There was some in the baby bottle. Um, let me tell you this, though. <laughs> the first drink that I got was <laughs> so, so, so disgusting yeah. that I, Jig went like, like this. As soon as Show touched, them what you did. As soon as it touched my tongue, I was like, <laughs> like as soon went, as it touched, she literally went. As up. soon as it touched my tongue, I spit it out, and the closest cooler that was next to me, I felt bad because I spit it in there, <laughs> and I grabbed the ice, and I was just like, ew. And um, but this one kept going, and I was oh, like, oh, hold up, I kept going because no one did to tell me it was something else up in that bottle. But the I first think, one you could taste it. I think no, mine was like, I thought it was hot vinegar fire or ball fire. I thought it or, was vinegar. Fireball. I thought it was hot fire. Vinegar. How do you know fireball? It's fireball. It's hard. Like, yeah, but how did JoJo know that? Because we told her the story and dad told her the story. Mm -hmm. Anyways, guys. Go to now. I kept going. And the first drink she drank, I drank after her. And I'm like, Jigs is tripping. She's being dramatic. And I went, oh, bro, what is this? I thought it was nasty hot vinegar. You know, I'm like, dude, I never tasted that in my life. And I swallowed that mug. And then another one and another one. And there was like. And what, you thought they were hot vinegars? There was eight There's eight drinks. I only got two right, guys. It was water and Pepsi. <laughs> and the rest, this lady. She listed everything in that bottle. I'm like, okay, that doesn't so that ooh, that don't sound familiar. And when I looked to my daddy, I said, Dad, I feel like a sinner. <laughs> I need a cooper. Oh my goodness. No, but dude, it was so funny. Like, it was that was innocent. I, I was so innocent. Yeah, it's just funny because we never had a hangover before. So after all those hard liquor, shut up, it was, <laughs> dude! It was like little. Whoa, she only wait. She only got like a little tip. Yeah, of it. because as soon as I I drank my tongue all, touched that, I knew that was. I drank all like like uh, I think seven of them, but dude, I woke up and I was like, dude, why does my head hurt? Like, and then I was hungry, That's and this, this girl at the party, we don't know. After we drank all that, this girl at the party was like. Oh my gosh, I need to invite you guys to my party because you guys look so lit. And I'm like, sis, what's going on? I don't even know what I'm feeling right now. <laughs> I'm dead. You're but, weird. Yeah, that was the first um, one. Which of your sibling is actually your favorite? Um, Honestly, I don't have a favorite. It's all equal. Yeah. I love every single one of you guys from Tyree, Sia, Josh, Jiggy, Bez, and Jojo. I love y'all. Oh, and Little Tubbs. Okay. Yeah, guys, we thank you guys for tuning in. Please do not forget, if you have any video suggestions, please let your girl know. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on the gram, on a snap, you know what it is. And we love you guys.